Hey guys, so we're at the thrift shop and right now we're looking at some books. We're looking at some books. Um, I'm trying to see if I can find maybe some like mindfulness kinds of books. Like Out of the thrift shop it's nighttime now because we literally were at the thrift shop for so long and we just stopped at mcdonald's saint's having a happy meal that he won't let go of and i am having a six piece mcdonald's meal i actually didn't know that they had a six piece meal um but i usually get like a six piece um chicken nugget because it makes me feel skinny they have a six piece meal so that's what i got i'm waiting for dominic because he's picking up some wine um Hi. Hello. Look at your other cup in here. Nasty. It's cold. Hey guys, happy Sunday. It's been a little while, but we're at the pumpkin patch. Oh. I know it's gonna be so much fun. It's my first time at a pumpkin patch ever. Um, and I'm just so excited because I get to bring my baby here. He just woke up from his nap. Let's see. Hello, you ready for the pumpkin patch? Yeah. I don't even know how, oh, oh, this is how you do it. Oh my God, I'm not gonna lie. My eyes keep watering because it's so windy outside and I can't keep it together. Babe, do you mind holding my purse? I think our first pumpkin patch was a success, right? You ever been to a pumpkin patch before? Have you? No, I have not. First pumpkin patch ever, oh my God. Yeah, but it was just like hella windy. It was not, like honestly to come here and to try to like take pictures and stuff, it's not the vibes. Just because it was so windy, um, my hair is tangled. <laughs> But 
I really liked coming here. The little animals were so cute, right? Got a lot too. You had a lot of fun, right? Same thing? It's been a while since I grabbed the camera. Hold on a second. You already know, same, same old, same old, but I'm having some eggs with a hash brown and I sprinkle some tzatziki, um, pieces of toast, feta cheese. Because honestly, I'm talking about how the whole vlogging thing hasn't been working out for me. So I'm in a mood of like changing my content around, but I definitely still wanna do vlogs. I'm just not gonna take them as seriously or make it like my, I don't know, like my weekly thing. Like I wanna focus on some other things when it comes to this channel. And I don't know what they are yet, but I'm sure that at this point, I'm just honestly going with the flow and seeing how I can pivot on this channel, change things up. And I'm just going with whatever feels right to me in my heart. But happy Tuesday. I'm having some coffee. Clearly I haven't even brushed my hair because man i don't know y'all like i i've been thinking about something and i have been liking my hair straight more than anything now every single day that i wake up i feel like i wake up and my hair is like tangled or like my roots are back to curly i don't know like it's also so so curly in my opinion to the point where in order for me to maintain straight hair all the time, my hair is just like easily reversible. I've just been thinking like, should I just relax my hair? Not that anybody cares, I just, it's just a daily struggle that I struggle with. Um, I came to the living room because I thought I was gonna go downstairs for a walk, but saint has really been taking a really long nap today which is a good thing because i feel like last night he woke up in the middle of the night because he didn't have his bottle another thing i went cold turkey on the bottles yesterday and i threw them all out so we're cold turkey on the bottles i'm just giving him his zach cups for now because he has too many teeth he doesn't need to be drinking out of a nipple anymore so he's transitioning right now from having those nasty bottles to a cup. Um, and he's been doing okay. I'm pretty sure like in the next few days, he'll probably get the hang of it that he no longer has bottles. Also, he's 18 months now and it's definitely about time that we start potty training him because it's about that time. And then today I just started to realize like I need to just like start fixing up his room in like a way where he's able to kind of like help himself because I definitely want to start teaching him how to like dress himself and you know just be like a little bit more patient when it comes to our morning routines and just like teach him like what his shirt is his pants are things like that um you know just so he starts to get the hang of it and starts being a little bit more independent um so i'm like really excited about this stage now too um, but since he is taking a nap i just decided to come out here and start journaling i literally have not journaled in weeks um sometimes i just don't ha like i just don't take the time to like sit down and just be with myself i've been realizing that for the past couple of weeks i've just been extremely like obsessed with my phone um and i just cannot let it go so i literally just let my phone sit in the room and i'm out here in the living room and i'm about to journal a little bit i don't know like i'm turning 28 in a couple of months um which to me just means that i'm 30 which is it's like a good feeling because i'm about to leave my 20s even though i still have a couple of years left but I'm about to leave my 20s and my 20s, my 20s were, they weren't easy. So I just can't wait to see what my 30s are going to bring. And I feel like I'm in the space now where I'm like reevaluating all of the boundaries, relationships, um, habits, all of those things that I want to just really take with me in my 30s and I need to start practicing those things now. 
Um, and I know I just feel like I'm in a new stage in my life where I'm just growing and evolving every single day and it just feels good. Um, so sometimes I just obviously like to sit down and journal because I don't know what my, ne my next stage in life is, um, which to me is just like, it's a good thing, but at the same time, I'm just like, okay, I really need to figure it out um, because I feel like I figured out such a huge part of my life, becoming a mom, and I kind of unlocked that side of myself, if you guys get what I mean. And then now I need to figure out like my next stage in life. And yeah, um, it just feels like a rebrand, like a restart of like, that's just what life is. Like, it's just what life is. Sometimes we think that we have to have it all figured out in our 20s. Um, but even if you do have it figured out in your 20s, you could be 40, 50 years old and want to rebrand, restart new and do something different and i feel like we should definitely just give people grace you know what i'm saying like not everybody's timeline is the same i'm just in that space where i'm just like okay i need to figure it out but at the same time like life goes on and things change so quickly that you can plan and plan so much and you're on here bored and I'm in that hibernation phase. It's cold outside and all I can think about is just eating. Literally, I've had three hash browns today and then I had my breakfast. What else did I have? I had apples and hazelnut spread and now I'm hungry again and it's like 3.30. It's that time of the year where you start filling up your tummy like a little squirrel. I have not gone to the gym in the past two weeks, but let me update you, okay? I weighed myself the other day and I know my starting weight. And then I think, I can't remember what month it was, but I think it was about maybe September or something like that. And I remember weighing myself. I'm not gonna tell you guys the number on the scale, but just know, I lost 15 pounds in total. I was just like shocked. I was like, yo, I have not seen that, that weight in a while. Um, and I haven't been going to the gym in the past two weeks. So I need to get back on track because I want to keep on losing more weight. Let me just cut up a little cucumber. Put it on top. I was not the biggest fan of cucumber, but listen. I love cucumber now. When cultures collide. I'm gonna sit down and have this, but. Mm. One thing about me, I'm gonna eat to a fault because I like to eat too much. I like to eat too much. And I know everybody likes to eat, but for me, I gotta just breathe food, okay? 